top secret. Russian military built secret detention camps for Americans off Alaska coast by Pamela Ray Shufert, May 22. Various news articles have been published today making a startling announcement. Here is an excerpt from one article. The Obama administration is reportedly giving away Rangel, Bennett, Jeanette, and Henrietta Islands in Alaska to Russia. The United States federal government drew the line to put these seven Alaskan islands on the Russian side. Many Americans have quickly drawn the conclusion that oil interests are the primary reason. However, based upon prior research, I would like to suggest there are even darker reasons behind this giveaway of these Alaska islands, especially when it appears that martial law is so very near in North America. As I write this intriguing article, I am living literally here on the coast of Alaska. I have been here helping a friend since December 2011. America's future Siberian type Gulag state. Alaska is filled with detention camp facilities and those military bases like Fort Greeley that can also be used similarly, including America's largest known detention facility reportedly able to hold up to one million hapless Americans or more, under martial law. This huge detention facility flies joint American and Russian flags, and Russian military advisors operate this gulag up, I mean detention camp. Just like ruthless Russian military have always operated Russia's infamous Siberian gulag detention camp system for decades. Just like American military also run infamous Gitmo in Guantanamo Bay or Abu Ghraib in Iraq. Military and detention camps with sordid abuses of prisoners always seem to go together, kinda like a Mario conversion of bacon and eggs or burgers and fries. Combinations, one just doesn't seem complete without the other. For details, please see link in show more. Leader Ohio 7 on ScrewTube.